Hi, this is Ginger from My Sister Scrapper. Today I want to share with you another little Christmas countdown mini album. This is the same style as the Photo Play Mad for Plaid mini album that I used as a countdown. Um, and I had some leftover papers from the Doodlebug Milk and Cookies collection that I taught a class in Arizona, which was super fun, by the way. Thank you to all those fabulous ladies for coming to class. So I had some leftover papers, so I went ahead and made another one of the cute little countdown mini album. So on the front cover I layered some of the design papers here and this is from the 12 by 12 page and this is a 4 by 4 cutout. I went through my stash and found a whole bunch of little enamel dots that kind of matched the little colors of the ornaments on the tree and added those to the tree. And a little yellow one for the center of the star. This is the spine and this is the back. And again I used the 6 by 6 papers except for this cutout here on the front and that's from a 12 by 12. The mini album measures 4.5 by 4.5 and the spine is two and yeah two two by four and a half so you open it up it's pretty simple again um i just used a bunch of leftover papers that i had from those class kits and i used some solid red cardstock as well so again i just cut this apart this little sentiment so i could add it here on the inside so santa claus is coming to town then merry christmas and the cute thing about the milk and cookies line and i used the six by six papers is it had a six by six page that had all the little numbers on it so the Number one is a little gingerbread man, and then these little inserts go right here. And these measure two and a quarter by three and a quarter, and the little white is two by three. And then they're playing on the back for your photo. So you can write here and put your photo on the back. And then you flip it over, and here's two. Again, another little photo mat, and three. And then here, each of these are going to have an insert as well. And I use the new Stampin' Up! tab punch for this. I made these out of red cardstock and I stuck some cute little sparkle enamel dots that are from Doodlebug as well on the little inserts there. Number four, this paper is adorable. I mean, you know, super cute. Cute little dog for number five and cute little gingerbread cookies. So again, I didn't take a lot of paper. I had a bunch of leftover scraps and just used it to make this book. Number six, I did have a full sheet of the <clears throat> six by six numbers, so that worked out really well. Here's number seven and eight. I think the stripe was probably my favorite paper because I didn't have a lot of it left. There's number nine, cute little ribbon candy, the gingerbread people. And all the photo mats are going to be the same. They're going to be this um, dotted paper and then they're white on the back, so I'm not going to pull those out. But there's four of them. Number 10, 11, 12, Mrs. Claus, really cute. And these two pages are um, from the 12 by 12 papers. Again, I had some leftovers. There's 13, 14's cute little mug of cocoa with Santa on it. And 15, 16, 17 is a little carton of eggnog. Oh, and this little piece is from the 12 by 12. Cute little um, figgy pudding. I think that's what it's supposed to be. And there's 18, 19, 20, and then 21. I love this image here. And 22 is a little kitty cat. 23 and then 24 and then on 25 I used I fussy cut this element it was from the 12 by 12 um, and put it here and made a cute little pocket and I fussy cut this Santa out and trimmed it off to make like a little tag and then I put a little piece of white cardstock on the back so I fussy cut around the little stitching here and then trimmed it off cute little Santa Claus so there you go everybody that's my little Christmas Countdown mini album using the Doodlebug Milk and Cookies 6x6 papers. And again, I just used leftovers. So there you have it. Thanks for watching. Bye.